a great honor, of course, for uh, the regional board or Kitty to ask me to do that and to take on that responsibility. And it, it did have its um, challenges, but I, I loved it. I loved uh, figuring out the local transportation. And even though um, we had quite the adventure, Jason and I, uh, figuring it out, it was worth every minute. And uh, I feel like I could be a local here in Antwerp now. I, I know the bus transportation and the subway transportation, train transportation. I've got it all down. So Nothing better. This is one of the best, I think. We have really, this, for girls, these girls have been fantastic, Jason. Nobody, nobody is, is, uh, has had, a, had a, any bad experience. They've all listened. We had a lot of times where we couldn't eat for a long, long time, and they were wonderful with it. A lot of, a lot of girls wouldn't have handled that. And uh, so I, I, as a coach here, I appreciate it. I can just, I'm really excited to be proud of the Region 5, the whole trip, and then it's a little different experience, but uh, two things is, one, I really, well, I miss the trouble with the U.S. team because then we don't have to squeeze on the bus and train or anything. <laughs> that part, I really miss that. But the other part I come to uh, just watching, I really enjoyed it just because I'm not that nervous, and, but still you try to cheer for U.S. team, but it's still a little bit different now you only ask down the floor and that nervous, so I really enjoyed it. I'm excited because I get to share it with Paige. It's her senior year. Um, it's been one of her goals to come here and now to watch Worlds and to travel to London. It's a really great experience and I'm really honored to be a part of it. I'm really excited that we got to be here. We have two athletes. Uh, this is a senior this year, so this is her third all-star trip. And I'm glad I got to come and experience Karen's first all-star trip. And I think everything, doing everything together and seeing the girls and sign shirts and all that things are experiences that they would not be able to experience. Um, just being J.O. athletes, so I think that that's really fun for them. Okay, being at Worlds and a couple of the other competitions this year without being out on the floor has been a really different experience than the last few years. Um, I'm used to be out there in the action and um, being stressed and everything. This Worlds is obviously a lot less stressful than the last one, um, but I'm still enjoying it tremendously and it, it's nice to sit and enjoy the competition and not worry about whether your gymnast is going to hit or not. Obviously this is the first time in, uh, we've had media on this trip. And I've been able to, you know, kind of document this entire trip for the girls and coaches, and it's been a lot of fun. Uh, it's been very interesting to see some of the things we've had to deal with while we're here. I think by far my trip with Lori today, this yesterday, was by far the best part of this trip. We uh, experienced quite a bit of interesting things that I've never experienced before. Uh, having buses being turned off on me and, uh, and getting lost. I got off in the wrong neighborhood. I got off in the wrong neighborhood. We were in the ghetto of, of, of whatever Belgium, I guess. And, uh, we thought we were out of the country. It turns out we did not go out of the country, but we thought we did. Uh, but overall, it's been a cool, uh, cool trip so far. Being here in a different country has been and overwhelming to say the least. Uh, lots of different cultures and um, letting, I guess as a young adult I probably didn't appreciate this type of stuff and these girls are given such a great opportunity to see things that they're going to look back on and think wow the things they see and are seeing and the culture, the people, the different ways of life. Uh, it's such an amazing opportunity and as an adult now I appreciate it. I just hope the girls do and realize how uh, amazing this is. This this international trip for the you know, Region 5 All-Star team was really great and for me being my first All-Star trip and my athlete Sydney Waltz it was awesome to experience it with her being her senior year and all and I've never international traveled neither has she so we kind of learned and went on and kind of flew by the seat of our pants the whole trip. <laughs> We're gonna share some stories about our lovely friend Gianni. This, this is, is our... Gianni if you don't know her. Uh, she has feet that swell up when she walks too much and on this trip that's a lot. Yes. She also it's... sits on a plane. Can she you sits imitate on a plane please? Like with this. her feet wrapped <laughs> around the table. You look... Oh thank you a lot you guys. I love you guys so much. Anytime. <laughs> we have more. Go ahead please. <laughs> um, I do. She wraps any China people that she sees, remember? In the, in the hall, you said, and then this lady turns around, you hug her, it was great. Um, I said, do you miss it? And she says, I miss no stress. No stress, right? Yes, no stress. Um, what else did Gianni do? She didn't fall down, Hillary fell down. <laughs> exactly. Gianni uh, stayed on her feet. Let's see. Hillary, Hillary. Hillary recovered well. Um, she got up this morning. Other than that, stay tuned. We'll get you some more tomorrow. Lots to come.